Alrighty, welcome to another edition of Achievement College, my step-by-step -step guide to getting you that gamer score. This is part six of my We Happy Few 100% real walkthrough. Uh, now, this one, this video is going to be a little bit different. We're just going to focus on getting two achievements, guys, and then what we're going to do is use this same save file to continue on at the start of the next video. Now, the two achievements we're going to work on right now, we're going to get the You Do Know Jack achievement and that is for collecting all the Uncle Jack shows. If you don't know what they are, I'm going to show you what they are in this video. There's also a list of those shows in my video description, so go and look at that. Uh, and then what you want to do is, if you want to go to the main menu, you can go to the theatre section, I believe it's under extras, and you can check which uh, Jack shows show up in the theatre section. And those are the ones you've already got. Now to get a Jack show, you have to find a TV and you have to listen or watch the show on the TV. There's a certain amount of time that you'd have to stand there listening or watching uh, the show and then it would register. It usually pops up on the screen somewhere as well. Now, one other thing I did off camera, guys, uh, I might explain this at the start of the next video, but just in case we forget, what I did off camera is I walked around the streets. Now, you might notice if you go into your map and you're in the exact same maiden home hatch that I'm in, your map may look completely different. I have explained this in earlier videos. What I did, guys, without chatting to anyone, without picking up any loot so you didn't miss anything, all I did is I walked up and down each one of these streets uh, using the bridges, the not crossing any bridges, but anything this side of each bridge, I've walked up and down the streets just to clear the map. So you can see there's a bridge there, there's a bridge there, but then all these streets. And what it's done, it's cleared the map and it's also pointed out these side quests as well as other things like houses and shops uh, so make sure you've got these side quests uh, activated that way you'll be up to date ready for the start of the next video but we've got uh, whatever that is I don't know how to say that I'm not even going to try we've got tits up downer I can definitely say that we've got the speakers corner there's a dig spot don't worry about that uh, lilies of the field looks like rain and the Church of Simon Says. So as long as you've got all that as a bare minimum, uh, we've also got the Finding Faraday. That I think that's the main quest we've got activated at the moment. So have that ready for the start of the next video. Now the second achievement we're going to work on for this video, let me grab the name of that one, is Don't You Have Somewhere Else To Be? It's really, really easy to get after we've done the TV one. So the Collect All Uncle Jack shows. First thing we're going to do, guys, is we're actually going to sleep until it's night time. I'm not sure what time is it now. 10, 19 a.m. We want it to be at least 9 p.m. So we're going to sleep until after 9 p.m. Try not to dream about trains. All right, and then we're going to head out into the town or into the... Yeah, town, I guess. And go to your map. Now, again, yours might be different, but like I said, I'm making this guide in a way that hopefully everybody can follow. We're going to find the nearest house marked on the map, and we're going to go find it. Uh, go over to the house. Don't forget there is a curfew. I can't remember which upgrades we have at this point, whether or not the uh, Bobbies will be upset with us. All right, so find the house. This is a house here. Can we get in here? Yes, we can. What we want to do is sneak in. Now, hopefully everyone's asleep. I'm going to find any... Uh... Hang on, I'll just make sure no one's downstairs. I was looking. We should be able to see their footprints. We don't need to worry about loot or anything like that. We're using this house to get our jack shows. That's the plan anyway. Okay, so I can see footsteps, which means someone's asleep somewhere in here. And I just want to make sure they don't interrupt us. So here we go. Take down on him. All right, is there a TV nearby? Make sure you crouch again. Oh, someone heard me walking around, I think. Yeah, someone. Someone heard that because I walked without crouching, guys. Because the stupid takedown animation makes you stand back up. Um, so I may have woken someone up here. There we go. Looks like they were... Looks like they're awake. Shouldn't matter too much if I can just... Here we go. Take him out. 
And crouch straight away before you press anything else. There we go. Ooh. Take her out. Alright, crouch again just in case there is someone else up here. I don't think there is. So I can hear a jack show right now. I think that's a TV coming from outside though. So we've got a TV here. What I'm going to do is just for... Just so I feel a bit more comfortable. I'm going to move these guys. Uh, drop. Now, it wouldn't actually matter if we do accidentally kill them either. Even though we're not killing anyone in this playthrough. Uh, because we're going to reload that save from earlier. See ya. Okay, now we've got our own little setup here. What you want to do is you want to have that list that's in the description, guys. You want to know which ones you already need. We want to turn on the TV. Now, sometimes you might be at the right time and a show will automatically play. Uh, if not, what you want to do, guys, uh, on that list, I'm going to have a set of times. You're going to see 7 a.m. You're going to see 12 p.m. You're going to see 4 p.m. You're going to see 7.30 p.m and 10 30 p.m now of course if you've got all of the shows in any of those time slots then you don't need to uh sleep to that time but what we would do if you were doing this for the very first time guys and you had none of the shows for example what you would do is you would sleep in the bed to 7 a.m or just uh we're gonna have to sleep just before 7 a.m so let's sleep to, around there. Oh, well, you've made your bed, Arthur. Around 6.30. By the time I finish ex explaining everything, it'll probably be 7 a.m. So at 7 a.m., a show on this screen is gonna start. If you haven't watched that show before, a little prompt will come up on the bottom of your screen and tell you that you've uh, watched that show now and you can cross that off your list. Once that show has finished playing or you've got that prompt on the screen, you would go and sleep till 12 p.m. 12 p.m. Come back here, watch the TV, watch another show, mark that one off your list, go sleep until uh, 4 p.m. Come back, do the same thing. Same goes for 7.30 p.m. and for 10.30 p.m. So those are the times, 7 a.m., 12 p.m., 4 p.m., 7.30 p.m. and 10.30 p.m. Obviously the 7.30 to 10.30 and then transitioning between those, you're gonna have to wait like I'm waiting now a little bit. And we're going to just keep sleeping and keep watching shows until we've crossed all of those off. I'm hopefully going to, about to get an example. Problem is I've already got all of the 7am shows. So even when one plays, uh, when our clock reaches 7am, you won't see anything pop up on my screen to say we've got a new show. Uh, but don't worry too much about that. Uh, what I might actually do is I'm going to pretend we just got a show there at 7am. I'm going to sleep until 12pm just before. No, I lay me Doesn't matter if you put sleep. it right on 12 or a bit after those times, the show should still be playing and you'll get the, uh, you should be able to, you know, get the show that you're required to get. I am missing one show at 12 p.m. So if I'm really, really, really lucky, we'll get it now. But sometimes you'll get double ups, guys. Even though you've already got them and you're missing some, you will get double ups. So you're gonna have to do this. You're gonna be sleeping and watching shows for days and days or days and days of in-game days, that is. All right, here we go. Welcome to News Hour. All sorts of amazing News things hour. have been going on in for sausage. I was hoping I'd know the name of this one. I don't actually know the name of this one. Bad. Okay, and by now, guys, watching that much of it, you would have got a prompt on your screen I'm if you haven't already that got that show, and you go to sleep to the security. until 4 p.m. It's just after. Now, normally you won't have to sit there and watch the show for that long, um, so you would actually have a little bit more time up your sleeve. But here we go, we have one of the 4 p.m. shows. And we're just going to go through all of the times again and again and again until we've got all those shows, guys. So it can take a while, it can be quite annoying. It's one of the, probably the most annoying achievement in the game. Um, and what I'll do, guys, is I'm going to skip the video ahead until I have the achievement popping on screen, hopefully. And then, if we don't have enough days yet, helpful, we'll need to get the uh, survive 50 days ah. achievement as well. Here's another letter. Haven't you? From... I think it's from... 
Ah, yes, it's from there. Dermot Nightingale of Gascoigne House, Upper Borough Walls. Dear Uncle Jack, a few days ago, I saw a bunch of citizens chasing someone. Hey, there it is. They ran right All right, guys, so you should be back in the video. I should have cut it just in here. That and was the final was show I needed. Well. And I'm pretty sure it we was the one for 4 p.m. I but hear you. I can't Who's remember uncle next. are you? Now, you'll see there the time is actually 4.34, so it keeps up. You it works, and I only have to listen to, you know, the first couple of seconds uh, you know of it, and you should have well, seen on the bottom left-hand side of the screen I don't think you should watch uh, the episode show a whole up. Bunch of citizens All right, and now you can see there also we are at day 33. Something wrong. What I want to do is get After to all, day 50. Now, you may have already got to day 50 if those so shows um, took you a while. Of course, anyway, I got a few in all my practice runs, so I didn't need to skip through as many days. So if you already got the achievement for surviving day 50, what you want to do is you want to load up your save. Uh, at, from the start of this video to be ready for the next part of the series guys if that's you thank you for watching uh, also don't forget to come and check out my patreon page if you feel like you can support my channel uh, that's only one dollar over on patreon there are other levels of course and if you uh, want to catch more of uh, Aussie Gamer 17 then please come and see my twitch channel as well I could uh, use all the support over there as well uh, meanwhile, I'm going to sleep 24 oh, hours God. over and Everyone over and over again dread. until we get to surviving 50 days. So let's do that and I'll, uh, I'll cut the video and join you at about day 49 so that we can get that achievement together. It's let's go. It's been a hard day's night, that was. Okay, guys, and here we are at day 49, so we should sleep one more day. Uh, just go backwards one to get it's 24 hours. It's been a hard day's night, that was. And here we are at day 50. Now, there it is. There it is. I was going to say, I don't know if we have to get to the end of day 50 or not. But there we are. We have survived 50 days. So, two rare achievements here in this uh, video, guys. That is going to be it. Once again, thank you so much for watching. If you're enjoying the series, don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Hit that like button. Of course, subscribe to the channel. If you want to support the channel, please head over to Patreon. There's a link in the video description where you can become a member of Aussie's Army on Patreon for just $1. Please come and watch me over on Twitch. Uh, the money I make over on Twitch are actually uh, far outweighs what I make for making these guides, guys. But I love making these guides. I want to keep making these guides. So come and support me on Twitch to help me make more guides like this. There's the bell, guys. You know what that means. Class dismissed.